This is a drum roll attempt by an inexperienced drummer. This more experienced drummer incorporates Dune's third law in gravity into a successful drum roll. Here's a demonstration of Newton's third law. The drum head applies the same force to the drum stick as the drum stick applies to the drum head. Every action according to Newton's third law has an equal and opposite reaction. Notice how the drum stick rebounds because of gravity. Now how sound travels through drums. The reason a drum makes sound is mostly due to the drum head vibrating due to a force produced by the drummer with a drum stick. The vibrations then force air outwards towards the resident's drum head which gives it more resonance. There are other factors that affect the pitch and sound of a drum. One of the biggest factors is the drum shell. There are many parts of the shell that determine the sound of the drum, including the shell's diameter, depth, thickness, and the fundamental pitch of the drum. The larger the diameter is, the larger the wavelength is, which means lower frequency, lower pitch, and louder noise. Thickness determines how loud the drum will be and how long it will resonate. The thinner the shell, the louder the drum will be. This is because there is less mass interfering with the sound wave, allowing for more projection. A thinner shell will also resonate more for those same reasons. Here there are two different shell types that I compared and helped show how the quality of sound is affected by the make of the drum. The shell determines the characteristics and attitude of the sound of the drum. Now, maple shells often have reinforcing One, clips, two, which one, is two, that three, bottom three, line located right there. Reinforcing clips add definition and focus to the sound of the drum. Now, bird shells are completely different. These shells have a short and fast sustain ratio. This means they have vibrate for a shorter period of time and decay much faster than a maple drum. This causes a high piss. Here's the difference between them. Here's maple. resonates for a long time and here's first